one of the big changes in the past uh, few years has been that um, there's increasing transparency um, in the supply chain because basically the internet gives you the ability um, as well as investors the ability to find out whatever they want about things going on in the supply chain and so we've really had to shift from a compliance mindset where uh, basically in the supply chain you're trying to obey uh, you know local law as well as international standards uh, you know like the uh, ILO core conventions and so on and the rise in investor interest in ESG and particularly looking all the way down the supply chain and the fact that they can actually gain visibility into a lot of this, it really makes companies step up uh, and uh, work more proactively with suppliers to have a more collaborative uh, mindset, to take an interest in supplier development and capacity building. Uh, and to really uh, have a lot of programs to go all the way down the supply chain. And basically the only way to do this is actually to digitize uh, a lot of the data collection. And that's one thing um, also different about the past is that, you know, the compliance mindset and audits and information collection and record keeping, it's all very manual. And it's not really that usable. I mean, you're just doing it in order to have it. And uh, now, when investors are really seeking information, as well as uh, consumers and other stakeholders, and the real golden, you know, the the the, the real uh, kind of what what people are seeking is uh, credibility of information, because we know that you know in the, a lot of the emerging markets, governance and institutions are weak, and so um, you know we don't uh, often have the information that like the the verification of information that. Uh, we would like.